I do quite a few full episodes and every once in a while I want to do an episode just for fun to see how it looks or what's going to happen, which is the case in this episode right here. I'm really excited about this one. I'm going to be going around Chicago to a few dog parks and I'm gonna keep it simple. I'm just gonna go up and ask the dog owners, excuse me, miss, does your dog lick your face by any chance? She was telling me that it's a licker. To reenact when their dog greets them when they get home from work, school. And to keep this equal, I'm going to try this test on large dogs, medium dogs, and small dogs. Not only to give us some more diversity, but uh, what I think is gonna happen is, I think the larger dogs are gonna lick slower than the smaller dogs. That's one of the things I'm curious about and that's one of the things we're about to find out. All right, so turns out the first dog of the day is gonna be Lucky. I mean, his name is actually Lucky. He's right over there, it's a boxer. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is, right there. He's a boxer and uh, it's as simple as the owner's just gonna call him up, he's gonna greet his owner, get a better understanding for what's going on when the dog licks the owner's face. That's the idea. Alrighty, let me just frame this up so it looks nice and pretty. Go Lucky, go! Go Lucky, go! Go Lucky, go! Need some encouragement. Got it! Good job, you're gonna be famous, you know that, right? You know what it feels like to be famous? So that looked pretty cool, no doubt. Our second dog is gonna be a small dog. The dog's name is Harley. Yeah, you ready, Harley? You ready to rock and roll? He licked me, and then I think he tried to bite me. But that's okay, I've been bit before. All right, let's do it. All right, I'm good. Whenever you're ready, Dana, you could go ahead. Back, back. Oh, I missed you. I missed you. This is what I find really amazing just about nature and technology. So the big dog at a thousand frames per second seemed just perfect, but with the small dog, it was a completely different story. The dog looked so much faster. The whole thing happened faster with the smaller dog. I'm gonna see if we can find a medium sized dog. Her name is Yoshimi, big licker, right in the face. Yoshimi, it's a cool name, right? That is a cool name. Wait, would you be willing to do it? Yeah, why yeah. not? Okay, awesome. What do you think? 
I love it. Let's All right, do it. Let's do it. This is going to be our medium sized dog, Yoshimi. You ready, Yoshimi? What frame rate should I shoot this at? Well, she said the dog's just a puppy, so I'm thinking, yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to do like 2,500 frames a second. Oh my God, was that it? No. Nah, it that's absurd. That's hilarious. Go, go, go. Yep, I got that one. Let's see, let's see. Oh. Like, I like her tongue out to the side. Yeah, That's look amazing. at that. Thank, Thank you so much. That was super best. awesome. Yes, yeah, so I'll give you fun. five too. That was awesome. But Yoshimi, awesome job Yoshimi. wherever you are. He's over there somewhere. So that was our medium dog. Uh, that was actually the coolest medium dog I've seen at this park, Yoshimi. So uh, yeah. That just about wraps this episode up. These dog parks were beyond amazing. Okay, maybe I'm exaggerating a little bit. The dog parks were cool. We saw a lot of different dogs and uh, it was quite a challenge to film, but uh, I, I would have to say it definitely wasn't what I expected to see, but that happens a lot of times when you get really close, really slow and really high resolution. There's a lot of information that emerges from that footage that you know you just don't normally think about or sometimes you can't even imagine and i think this was one of those cases so hopefully you enjoyed the episode uh you know share your thoughts and leave a comment below um hit the subscribe button check out that bell because some things have changed here uh, with that whole belt situation that's about it i'm out of here time to go home and take a shower <laughs>